privilege also at the meeting that there were mistakes which were committed in some areas like Kabul and so forth. Are you now inviting the ICC to take a fresh look at the Northern Uganda situation or are you otherwise? The old debate, if not answered adequately, will continue to be relevant. And uh, it continues to be relevant because government has not addressed the issues about the conflict in northern Uganda. The world has not addressed in a balanced way the issue about the conflict in northern Uganda. Can you imagine by 1997 when, government, when the World Bank negotiated a deal with the government of Uganda and the government of Uganda shifted from a socialist ideas where they were using butter trade with Libya. The World Bank considered Uganda in a post-war recovery as a country. And yet at that time, half of the country, from Soroti to northern Uganda, was impossible, was inaccessible. Nothing was taking place apart from gunfire. But the World Bank kept it in their documents. Still now, you can read, you can access all that. That Uganda was peaceful, it was now undergoing then a recovery program, and therefore they needed to give it money. The government of Uganda at that time sealed off. The war the World Bank knew was the NRA war that took over power. And after that, the war that began in 1996 was a gone history. That's why I refer to the international community as well. So the international community have also been part and parcel of sealing the conflict in northern Uganda to the rest of the world. And therefore, we should talk about this. Now, Mr. Lokwago, therefore, the, the old debate will continue to be relevant unless the international community and the government of Uganda and the people of Uganda address themselves to the core issues to avoid future problems. The lack of ICC balance in investigation, of course, was apparent because the ICC was invited to come here by the government of Uganda. ICC did not come here on their own. ICC were invited by the government of Uganda and in the assumption that the government was clean, they focused on the LRA atrocities. They focused on what they were invited for to come and do. But also you have to be fair to, to, to ICC. That they have this war, when you want to address it in a just manner, ICC will not be the best person the best institution to address it. That's where the dilemma with the UN will, will, will come in. Because the war started in 1996. No, 1986. The mandate of, of the ICC started, I think, in July 1996. Yes. When they were... Yes. When, I, I think 1998. ICC was con constituted, I think, 1990, July. June or July 1998. And therefore, but that war has been going on. Now, it will be extremely, extremely challenging for ICC to make judgment on some of these issues based on their mandate. If the war had started in 1998, ICC would fully un un understand that. And therefore, ICC would also be in a, a dilemma in trying to cut off the past and looking towards the future because the war would not be separated into two wars. That the war started in 1998 and the war that was started in 1986. Uh, that war, all wars started in 1986. And therefore, the most relevant body would be a body that would handle it. So the ICC's hand also get tired. But we also have the, the war, the, 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 the International uh, uh, Court of Justice, which has been in, in, in existence for, 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 for a long time. So you judge ICC from that point, uh, and, and uh, when the president talks about mistakes, you know, I, I think the, the, the president should also mind his, his language. When you kill people, you don't talk about mistakes. He should have admitted that actually we kill people. He cannot say mistakes. Those are not mistakes. Mistakes, you cannot sit in an operation room. I have President Museveni in my records of books, quoted, life where he says, we massacre them, we kill them, we shall deal with them. The other day we taught them a lesson in Kwanakla. We taught them a lesson in Awaj. We taught them this. They will no longer support the rebels. Okay, Isaac. Uh, on when 
when abducted, the distance, the span from our, we all come from Achua as a constituency, but the span is about 35 kilometers. It was abducted from Paibona. For us, we were abducted from Paicho, a distance of about 35 kilometers away. So he also talks about it, about I was abducted, about I was a child, about how, 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 how all those things happened. Let me briefly now end up by saying how I managed to escape. I managed to escape which I couldn't do, I managed to escape because I was taken to the sick bay with my injury. Now, when I came back, I reported to a detachment for the government uh, a, a UPDF unit. Now, that commander is called somebody, is it Masereka? Somebody, I, I don't remember the name very well. They didn't want us to know the name, actually. So that man had to put me in their detention facility. I became very, very annoyed. I even told him to his face that you failed to protect us when we were not yet abducted. You failed to secure our release when we were, we were abducted. Now, why do you again treat me like that? So it became another story. They said, this is a real rebel. How can he talk like that? Then I wondered, how can I become a real rebel? when I was 16 years. So it was very serious. But luckily, another commander came and quickly secured my release, which was very fortunate. I was taken to the main barrack in Gulu. Then I was taken to World Vision Facility, where, where they keep people in a rehabilitation center. So uh, with all this brief story, I know what it is with those who were abducted, including me. What they need, is not just amnesty. What they need is also not just administration of justice the way it, it, some people think it should be done, indicted here, indicted where, taken to court in Uganda or in the US or in, in the Netherlands, in, in ICC. What is most important is rehabilitation of the formerly abducted. So more of what should come from me will come from your own question when you, you, you wish to ask me any question. Okay, Isaac, uh, on when, when abducted, the distance, the span from our, we all come from Achua as a constituency, but the span is about 35 kilometers. It was abducted from Paibona. For us, we were abducted from Paicho, a distance of about 35 kilometers away. So he also talks about it about I was abducted, about I was a child, about how, 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 how all those things happened. Let me briefly now end up by saying how I managed to escape. I managed to escape, which I couldn't do. I managed to escape because I was taken to the sick bay with my injury. Now, when I came back, I reported to a detachment for the government uh, a, a UPDF unit. Now, that commander is called somebody, is it Masereka? Somebody, I, I don't remember the name very well. They didn't want us to know the name, actually. So that man had to put me in their detention facility. I became very, very annoyed. I even told him to his face that you failed to protect us when we were not yet abducted. You failed to secure our release when we, are, we were abducted. Now, why do you again treat me like that? So it became another story. They said, this is a real rebel. How can he talk like that? Then I wondered, how can I become a real rebel when I was 16 years? So it was very serious. But luckily, another commander came and quickly secured my release, which was very fortunate. I was taken to the main barrack in Gulu. Then I was taken to World Vision Facility, where, where they keep people in a rehabilitation center. So uh, with all this brief story, I know what it is with those who are abducted, including me. What they need is not just amnesty. What they need is also not just administration of justice, the way it, it, some people think it should be done, indicted here, indicted where, taken to court in Uganda or in the US or in, in the Netherlands, in, in ICC. What is most important is rehabilitation of the formerly abducted. So more of what should come from me will come from your own question when 
you, 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 you wish to ask me any question.